Hello, I'm Alexa Balbuena, your Balof product specialist here at ENM. Today, I'll be talking about how you can make your pressure sensors a little bit more flexible. Whether it's to standardize on one pressure sensor across all of your lines, or just future-proofing your devices, Balof's new generation of products may be the way to go. Even if it's just a quick fix for your hydraulic or pneumatic systems, these pressure sensors can track different kinds of fluids, such as gases and other viscous media. So if you need to measure your tank pressures or monitor values to self-correct your processes, these sensors go a long way in diagnostics and error-proofing. For those of you who don't know, Balof offers three different form factors to their pressure sensors. Front flush pressure sensors, pressure sensors without display, and pressure sensors with a display. The new generations of pressure sensors are for that last group, the ones with a display. This improved product line now has increased options for your available outputs. Before, you would have to select your output type, but now everything is configurable with one product number. An analog signal with 4 to 20 milliamps or 0 to 10 volts, an NPN or PNP signal, or IO link. So why does this matter? This gives you an increased flexibility when you're creating your systems. There's been a growing need in industry to push for transitioning all of your devices to an IO link network. This is due to its enhanced control to your devices via sensor monitoring, parameterization, and diagnostic features. If you'd like to learn more about IOLink and the general advantages associated with it, we have a few videos in our company page. We'll also provide a few links down below if you're interested in watching them. The biggest takeaway here is that with the new generation of valve pressure sensors, you can still tailor fit your devices to your system, but still future-proof them. You may want an analog sensor now, but maybe later down the line you'll be interested in some of the IOLink features that we've mentioned. You can still use the sensor that you have on hand right now, and still have a pretty seamless integration later down the line. Another common instance that we see these pressure sensors being used is in a large plant. Maybe you have different needs in different systems and different lines within one location, but you still want to standardize on one pressure sensor. This one will do the trick. Everything from the original Balof sensors still hold true. The wide variety of pressure ranges, the process connection options, the enclosure ratings, and the connection housings. So while maintaining all of the typical components that you'd expect from this device, you also have a greater sense of flexibility ensured with the parts that you have selected. Hopefully this video gives you a better idea on the newer features on Balof's new generation of pressure sensors. I'm Alexa Balbuena, your Balof product specialist here at ENM. If you have any questions on the product shown, give us a call and we'll help you right out. Thanks for watching!